right, there's Sal. Let's play this in full first. My job is to try to find the truth. The truth. <laughs> you wouldn't know the truth if it kicked you in the head. All right. There's some good stuff in there. I think my general impression is that if it feels a bit timid. If you listen to the sound. My job is to try to find the truth. The tr that all worked. That totally works in terms of the energy. Truth. <laughs> you wouldn't know the truth if it kicked you in the head. And, and that works as well. The only thing is I hold this longer, that shape. The head. And then go back. It feels like we're going back a bit too soon. Now, with that being said, I mean, if you would spline this, it would totally work. Again, there's really good stuff in there. I like that hand pose. There's a clear silhouette. At least there is this in there in terms of the hand on there. And that's a nice, again, pose as well. It has a little bit of a one arm gesture thing, but I was going to say bring it out a bit more to here. That's my arm. Just because of silhouette, it's a bit overlappy with the upper arm and forearm. But then you're getting even more into kind of the cliche one arm wave acting. So maybe if you don't go further than this, I wouldn't go too straight. Like something where we still understand the structure is a bit of a, you know, something like that. I think it's a good twist on the one arm gesture. The truth. The truth. <laughs> you wouldn't know the truth. And all that works as she goes back. A nice asymmetry there. The lean back is great. And for him, I like that little going back as she comes forward. I like that. There's some good stuff in the face already. And especially opening the mouth before he says something. Some good twists, and you can see there's some implied body movement in there. I think that's all great too. My the two things I would say: she talked, leans forward, and the focus is on her. That's great. Then we go to him, and then he says that, and then I'd be careful. He keeps on talking while she has a big move. There might be a moment of where the audience goes back to her. Because she has such a big thing and we might miss what's going on there. Just to throw that out there. You might have to retime that if you want to make sure that the, the audience doesn't lose focus there. Just to make it super clear that the attention is always on him. That's the first thing. If you would keep it like this, that's to me the biggest thing to change in its current form. Where I feel like, mm, careful, there's a bit of an overlap there. Because you can always just have it when he turns and then looks at her. Because then as an audience, we go, the gaze goes over to her. Now when she moves, oh, okay, we're ready to look at her. But then we would miss kicked. We will miss that because then the audience would rest there before we go back to him on this last move. So that's the only thing here. Just kind of depends where you want the audience to look. So that overlapping thing is a bit of a conflict there. That's one the other thing is, which goes back to what I said before, being kind of timid. If you turn the sound off, it just kind of depends what you're going for. This could totally work. This could totally be a shot in a movie. Because it doesn't always have to be crazy, crazy, crazy movement. So I just wanted to throw that out there that it could be something where as she does this, and I like that, you know, she's a bit more closed up, so she wouldn't have too much of, of a movement there. I could see him being... Let's see, I'm gonna have to voice quickly. You wouldn't know the truth if it kicked you in the head. Like this could be something where, and don't do this. I mean, you can't be all like, I'm just throwing this out there. What if he would look away and be slightly hunched over, looking this way, right? Nose here, like that's actually his orientation. And he'd be busy doing something here. And then, and then the truth, that's when he would still point it this way, look up. And then during, ha, he would do a big turn. And when he says all this, you can imagine that he's actually turned away from us. We don't see the face, but he takes a step towards her. And that's why she looks, she moves back too. But it's okay to not see his face because again, he's turned away from us. You'll imagine that he is three quarter taking a step. You can have a slight camera pan over, just have some set pieces there. She moves over. And then kicked could be a thing where he would again turn again towards us and he could say this the nine profile or maybe even three quarter and have again i'm not the one to advocate more gestures i'm usually the one that tell people no just take gestures out but it could be something where it doesn't have to be a gesture it could be kind of a shrug with a nice little head accent 
And then the head would be... Like, he would end up being... Here-ish. But maybe again, three-quarter. Well, maybe here. So he starts looking this way, three-quarter. And he ends three-quarter this way. But just with a bigger flourish. Again, I'm not usually the one to say at more. But I just wanted to throw that out there. It could be also something where... That is one performance that's a bit more subtle and subdued. Where it's just kind of... She's staying within this realm of... Going, you know, from here to here. So, like, an orientation from here to here. And he is the one that has a bit, a bit of a bigger move. Or, even though I like this a lot already, especially with the hand pose, you can also throw this away where he is the one that's a lot more subtle. And she has, because she is further away and you see more of the body, she would have bigger body moves and bigger shifts left and right. Get closer to him. I don't know. But then it's just the energy in the voice is bigger on him. And that's why I was gravitating towards him having more movement. At the same time, uh, totally up to you. Again, it's already working. Just wanted to throw out that idea. All right, thanks. All right, there's an email. You can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.